Hello, my souls, and welcome back to Evil Within. Now, if memory serves, the end of the tutorial is somewhere up here soon, but I'm not 100% certain. So, I don't know. Oh my god, come on! Get up! Get up! Flat. Ah, there we go! Oh my god, the only thing that would make this game better is if you could play it on the damn Oculus Rift! Also, it's your leg. Oh. <clears throat> this guy apparently is a smoker. Dude, you should have given myself with him. Darkness twisting me around. The imagery on this game is always so messed up. Okay. Okay, he somehow doesn't have the wound on his leg anymore. That's the thing. That's the fun part about this. Shit. 
the needle. Turn that bus into spaghetti. Damn it. Are we cut off from everyone? Everyone must be dead. Everyone all right back there? Just a few bumps. We're fine. 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 We will be once we're fine. far away. Fine. A little further and we'll be fine. Our game here, shall we? Next chapter. I actually thought about playing this through uh, as chapter by chapter, but I remembered there are some chapters that take up to, like, I think an hour and a half. So, can't really do that one. Chapter 2, though. Remnant. And this would be why there's an epilepsy warning! Bodies found in Lakeside Town. Cause of death remains a mystery. More than a dozen mutilated bodies. Bodies found in uh, village of Elk River. Several residents unaccounted for. Um. Okay. Yay! I got brain juice. I'll show you what I mean by brain juice Hello? in a little bit. Anybody there? There's a lot of cockroaches. Are we Hello, alone? lady. Is everyone else all right? The city? Whatever are you talking about? You are the only soul here. Right now. This place is necessary for you. 
You're always welcome here. I've been hospitalized? I'm afraid I cannot answer that. Please, sign in here. Without signing in, there is no way to ensure your future memories. That is kind of creepy, and that's an interesting save mechanic. <clears throat> this way, please. Smells like medicine. Hey, we have a hundred brain. Use. You are all right. Please relax. Please have a seat. Let's have a seat, shall we? What the hell? You mustn't fight it. This is for your own good. No. Stop. Upgrade skills. Green gel can be used for upgrading individual uh, skill parameters. There now. You see? All better. Lady, am I going crazy? Huh? Now what makes you say that? <laughs> I'll be waiting. That'd be an interesting way to die. <laughs> That'd be a really interesting way to die. Shit. What the hell is going on? Where am I? Okay. The origins of the medication in this travel syringe is unknown, but it provides moderate health restoration. Edmund, where are you? Connolly. Hey, hey, brain juice jar. It is really freaking dark. Okay, so that's the run button. Wish I had a flashlight. I know there's some things over here in the darkness that are worth grabbing. There's gotta be some stuff in the darkness worth grabbing. It's not a horror game if that's the case. This guy can't run for, well, anything. Hey, brain juice jar. I cannot run to save his life.
Oh, there we go. Brain juice jar. Oh my god, so the creep factor on this game gets really... Nope, that's not the button I wanted. Creepy factor on this game can get really, 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 really weird. There we go. Now I have a light. Light can be turned on and on, toggled on and off. On a whim. More brain juice. Warning me about this. You are Leslie, right? I'm a police officer. Maybe I should help you. Should help you? Shit. How am I gonna get you to a hospital? Hospital. 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 Hospital! What the fuck? There we go. Items acquired. Trap parts. Trap parts are needed to craft bolts and uh, for the agony crossbow. They're used in the inventory screen. Okay, cool. Okay, so... Using matches. Approach a fallen enemy and press B to burn them, destroying them completely. Burning consumes one match. If the same enemies are close enough, they can all be burned with one match. Other things besides corpses and enemies can also be burned. So burning corpses is kind of a nest. Oh. Ooh, that made me jump just a little.
Ah, wrong button. Oh, no. Mm. Wasted a bullet. That's another thing. Bullets in this game are insanely rare. So, yeah. Not something you want to waste. Okay, there's that. Brain juice. Journal Sebastian Castanellis. November 20... Uh, 20... Or... 2004. Finally got my uh, gold badge. Detective Sebastian Castellano. Or Castellanos. Castellanos? I like the sound of that. Seems a long time coming, but they say that I'm uh, one of the fastest ever to rise through the ranks. Can't wait to get started. I know th oh, that I can do more good as a detective than I ever could as a beat cop. Plus, I don't have to wear that damned uniform anymore. The pay bump doesn't hurt either. KCPD needs all the help they can get. There's a seemingly disproportionate amount of crime these days. Crimson City is my home, and it's my job to protect it. Shit! <clears throat> Hello. Again, this is why I was saying epilepsy warning, what the folks. Back here again. I must be losing it. Really quick, I'm going to check something, see if I can, uh... Remove letterbox. There we go! Letterbox mode was starting to drive me just a wee bit batty nuggets. I don't know if that was a bad dream, or this is. Whatever is the matter. So, folks, for those of you who are wondering what letterbox mode is, what I just turned off, watch the screen and you'll see. Now, there's a black border right now at the top and the bottom of the screen. By turning that off, With it off, though, now it's full screen. Missing! Leslie Withers. Uh, psychiatric patient Leslie Withers disappeared from the locked room at Beacon Mental Hospital. Serial killer on the loose. Victims had surgery performed on them. Police believe slaying the work of a serial killer. Missing person in several, uh, persons in several local communities. Save the game here. Door is locked. Let's see just what we can do with our brain right now.
Syringe recovery. Oh. Weapons. Importance of matches, I'm gonna upgrade that. It'll probably be one of the first things I get to max too. But I'm also gonna up the damage of my gun, of my handgun in particular, <clears throat> and the amount that I can carry. Put in there. There. Hello. You know what I mean, though, by it's one of the brightest horror games I've ever fuck <laughs> ever played. Come on. Turn around. Stab right in the head. Right kid. First things first, I'm gonna check around here really quick. See if there's any brain goo. Because brain goo early game is really, really important. Oh, perfect. I almost forgot how to put my weapon away. Actually, I didn't know how to put my weapon away. I just figured it out. Hold B. Okay. So folks, I'm going to be on the lookout for those little uh, statues because they do contain keys to help with uh, upgrades. Well, that wasn't creepy at all. You guys from around here? I don't know where.
Ain't that pretty. So, folks, this is going to be where we end this particular uh, episode. That barbed wire enema would have essentially hurt like hell. <laughs> Anyways, if you enjoyed the gameplay or the commentary, give us a like. If you want to keep up with this or any of our other uh, series, hit subscribe and ring that bell. But for now, this is Kit the Solus signing out. So until next time, everybody. Bye-bye.